Welcome to CTN. I'm your host, Robert Van Sluten. In this episode, I'm going to start talking about protocols. Protocols are a feature of Objective-C. Um, they enable you to extend the interface of classes, and they can be used across multiple classes. What a protocol is, it's a, it's a list of methods, and a class can adopt a protocol. In other words, it should implement the methods. The methods can be required or optional. In other words, in a protocol, you can say, if you adopt this protocol, you need to implement the method. Or you can say that the method is, the methods are optional. They're defined in header files, and there is a protocol directive in Objective-C, and you just simply follow that with the name of the protocol. There's a required and optional directive that indicates that the, the methods are either required or optional. And of course, then there's the standard end. The default is required. So in this particular case, it's unnecessary to stay required. I mentioned in the pre previous episode that the application delegate is a delegate of the application and the way that is implemented is by a protocol. If you actually look at the header file for the application delegate, you'll see these the bracketing with a pro with a protocol name and the protocol is UA application delegate. That is a protocol. A class can conform to multiple protocols by having a comma separated list. Now, what is happening here is delegation is the notion of passing along responsibility to another object. And the responsibility that you're passing along is defined based on the definition of a protocol. You may ask, OK, some methods can be optional. Um, how does an object know whether the class has actually implemented the method or not? There is a method called conforms to protocol that you can ask an object, do you conform to this particular protocol or this particular method? Um, you can ask, you're asking for this protocol, do you implement this method? And the directive at selector says that this method name, and you put a, a selector in those parentheses, and what this is asking is its basic if statement, do you or don't you? Of course, the yes is a um, defined as a bull. If it does implement it, you go ahead and invoke it. If it doesn't, you do some kind of default behavior. That's the end of the intro to protocols. We're going to do a delegation example in the next episode. Thanks for watching.